This is Math 141 practice final, number six. We're going to uh, find some inverses for these. So this first one, I'm going to replace that f of x with a y, uh, and then just keep that as it is. And now I'm actually making the inverse. So I'm actually flipping the, in, the input and the output. So y becomes x, and x becomes y. Great. And so now my work from here is to get y all along. So I'm going to multiply both sides by 5y plus 7. Get it out of the denominator. Over on the right hand side, I'm left with this. Over here, I'm going to distribute that x. So I have 5xy plus 17x. Great. Uh, so now I notice I have y's on both sides. I want to get all the y's on the same side and anything that doesn't have a y on the opposite side. So I'm going to subtract 17x from both sides. And I'm going to subtract 2y from both sides as well. So over here, I'm going to end up with a 5xy minus 2y. And on the right-hand side, a negative 17x Oof. minus 4. My 7 went crazy. So here, uh, these terms both have a y in it. So I can factor the y out. So I have y times uh, 5x minus 2. Final step to get y all alone, divide by the 5x minus 2. So I end up with uh, y equals negative 17x minus 4 over 5x minus 2. And uh, I like it. There's my answer. And instead of writing y here, I could write f inverse of x. Next one, right away. I can stop. It has an x squared in it. That's not invertible. I don't have to do it because it can't be done. There's no full inverse for this.